I'm Raki from transtetech.com. Today I'm going to show how to configure load balancer with Nginx. Load balancer is required for distribution your traffic between multiple servers. Suppose if you have one server and there is huge traffic come for a moment, your visitor can't show your site. Maybe they will get server busy. To avoid this kind of issue, we should use load balancer with multiple server to serve your site. To configure load balancer, we need at least two server or more. Uh, today I am going to show you how to configure load balancer with two server. So let me connect my server and show you how to configure load balancer. So let me connect my server. Here is my first test server and the second one. Here is my second server. So I have I have already have uh, configured the web server uh, in two of the server. So uh, let me test first the web how it's showing. So my first server. Here is showing its server on my second server. Here is showing uh, its server 2. I just configure server 1 or 2 because uh, uh, when we configure load balancer, that time uh, we identify the traffic that from which server the uh, site is coming. For that purpose, I have added the number here. So we can easily identify that uh, which server is serving the site currently. Uh, for this uh, we need to co configure nginx for one of my server so i am going to configure nginx my first server so it can be easily to understand so let me install the nginx uh, sudo it is installing oh, okay so let me check seems it failing so let me run a ticket update and try again Yes, now it is installing. So let me check is it installed or not. Yes, it is installed. So now we are co going to configure Nginx for the load balancer. So, how we are going to uh, configure this? For configure load balancer, we need to edit. Uh, nginx uh, default files that uh, nginx site uh, enable and there is default file so we will edit that default file uh, there is lots of thing it is a by default thing so we don't require anything uh, so I am going to delete all the thing first and then we will configure what we need so I'm going to delete all the file and make it a blank file. Okay, it is now blank. Now I'm going to add uh, 
uh, what is uh, we required so we are going to configure that our load balancer that this stream and uh, name the uh, load balancer module so i am uh, uh, giving it back int because uh, our uh, back end server will be here so i am putting the server name here so it, it is the port and the second server is the two server so if you have more server you can add like this so now we are going to the root properties uh, actually uh, uh, where that uh, request will come and uh, it will serve so it will be the server that nginx uh, default configuration so i'm going to location add location this is root location so any uh, traffic come to root location it will serve from back end so it will proxy plus HTTP delete that is done and we are configuring that is the main configuration so we are going to save it and restart nginx we reload the nginx and now we will test that our configuration is working or not so now i am going to hit this and we should get the yeah, yes I am getting the response from server on so again if you hit we should get from server 2 yes and again you hit it will come from server 1 like this so every time it will start from server 1 and server 2 so that is the main configuration I think you will do it easily so that's all from me thank you thank you for watching my video thanks again bye